Redux versus Context API, Part 1. In React, the usual way to share data between components is through prop drilling, passing data from parent to child. However, with global state management, we can share data across components more efficiently. Two popular methods for this are Redux and the React Context API. Redux. Redux is a popular JavaScript library used with React to manage application state. It follows a predictable state container pattern, offering a centralized store to efficiently manage and organize the application's state. First centralized state management, Redux store all state in one place, making it easier to debug. Second, predictable updates. Redux ensures changes follow clear rules defined by actions and reducers, making state updates easy to understand and predict. Redux is best suited for large, complex applications where managing state across multiple components can become challenging. It is particularly useful for apps with deeply nested component structures, as it simplifies state sharing without the need for excessive prop drilling. Additionally, Redux excels at handling asynchronous data flows, making it ideal for applications that require fetching and updating data from external sources in a predictable and organized manner. Up next, we'll dive into the React Context API. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content.